The sharp strengthening of the dollar in a matter of months has sizable macroeconomic implications for almost all countries, given the dominance of the dollar in international trade, and finance. Since 2000, the dollar is at its highest level having appreciated 22% against the yen, 13% against the euro, and 6% against emerging market currencies including Southeast Asia since the start of this year. For many countries fighting to bring down inflation, weakening their currencies relative to the dollar has made the fight harder. On average, the estimated pass-through, of a 10% dollar appreciation into inflation, is 1%. Such pressures are especially acute in emerging markets, reflecting their higher import dependency and greater share of dollar-invoiced imports, compared with advanced economies. This is how the currencies in the region performed in 2022. Cambodian riel is the strongest currency in the region, depreciated by an average of 1.3%, followed by Brunei, 2.3%. Among the major economies in the region, the Singaporean dollar is the least depreciating currency in the region, depreciated by an average of 2.4%, followed by the Vietnamese dong by 4.2%, and Indonesia's rupiah by 5.6%. On the other hand, the Malaysian ringgit, Thai baht, and the Philippine peso are the hardest hit currency in the region amongst the major economies, depreciating by an average of 8.2%, 9.4%, and 12.4% respectively. Meanwhile, the worst performer in the region are the Burmese kyat depreciated by 18.4%, and the Lao kip at 58.2%. However, the Philippine peso and the Thai bath are in the recovery stage, strengthening their exchange rate compared to the previous months. While the Vietnamese dong, Malaysian ringgit, and Indonesian rupiah are weakening in the past weeks.